Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Daytime with Midnight. I'm your girl Midnight. Square up, cuz. Anyways, today we are going to be talking about my face. Um, what's happening with it? Why does it look like this? What are we gonna do about the situation? And we're also gonna be talking about the sun. So I hope you guys are ready because we're talking today about black people sunscreen. The sunscreen of the blacks. The blacks. Anyways. Before we get started with the video, please like, comment, share, and subscribe to the channel. I really appreciate it. We are moving our way up. We're going to be at 200 soon, so I am very happy about that. Also, please follow me on my TikTok as well as my Instagram. Same name everywhere at Daytime with Midnight. Now, my new post schedule, if you guys didn't know, is on Saturdays um, instead of Sundays. And next year, uh, I'm going to start doing um, two times a week, Wednesday and Saturday. So let's hope that I can keep to my schedule. I've planned a lot of videos so far and I'm also doing the 12 days of Christmas um, so if you guys are really into like the 12 days of Christmas type of thing I have like 12 videos almost hit something all like planned and prepped for the 12 days of Christmas so let's get started with the video okay y'all so you can already see that my face look a little white um, sunscreen we already know black community I've been doing this wrong they, sunscreen been doing this wrong for years they um, making us look blue making us look white um i don't know about y'all but i ain't white i like to look brown i like to look like i'm brown um this right here the ashy look is not working out for me but i wanted y'all to see it i wanted y'all to see it and i wanted just us to live in this moment together um before we take this venture to something so brilliant so amazing so great i'm my expectations for this product are to the top i want to look like I want to look perfect I, if if it doesn't look good I'm gonna be so disappointed but I digress so I'm gonna take this off my face to get back to a neutral state a neutral state of brownness speaking of my mother guys my mother is um, pregnant and aunt and she's having her baby like very soon her birthday is like two days after her due date I'm so excited I want the baby to be born on her birthday I want it born on her birthday I've been praying for that, that that's what I want in life um but besides that because I'll just be so cool anyways besides that though my mother has a candle company called the scented luxury um I help her out I am her one and only employee <sighs> the life of a young adult child daughter is, is never over so um, please go check out her website, The Scented Luxury. I'm going to put the link down below. We're doing a sale. We're trying to get rid of everything because we are rebranding. We have new styles, new vases, new everything, and it's going to be so great. Um, she makes all natural soy wax candles. Um, and, you know, you can wait. You don't have to buy for the sale. You can wait until we rebrand. I will be talking about it on my channel as well. And then check her out. So, yeah. Okay, so the part that we're going to be testing is called Black Girl Sunscreen. Now, I have a really extra interesting uh, video coming up. <clears throat> yes, I do. And I needed some sunscreen, so I was on the hunt for this stuff. And I found it. They do sell this at Target, as well as on the website and at Ulta. So I'm really, really, really excited for this. I'm going to read it to you. I'm going to read it in a British accent. I apologize to all my British people, but I'm doing it anyway. <clears throat> Black Girl Sunscreen. Moisturizing sunscreen lotion for face and body. Broad spectrum SPF 30, infused with Jehovah oil, no Jehovah and avocado. Water resistant, 80 minutes. Oxybenzone and ox octinoxate free. Ultra sheer, no white residue. Fragrance free, three fluid ounces or 89 milliliters. Okay, now it. I guess bye bye umbrella. I I don't know what that means. Um. Oh. The Umbrella Sunscreen brand people buy by Umbrella, is that, oh, they're calling them out. Oh, it's aggressive, it's getting nitty gritty. Now for this product, it only, um, it says, it only lasts for 80 minutes in the water. So if you're going swimming, you need to get out every 80 minutes and <laughs> reapply it, cause it's gonna come off. Immediately after towel drying, um, you should apply it. And it says after all at least every two hours if you are like not being in the sun like sweating or nothing I don't know why I'm talking a British accent but that really felt good 
Okay, but so I already opened it, the product. I haven't tested it out at all. I haven't tested it out at all. My face is nice and ready. And I'm just gonna sniff it because it says it's unscented, so I just wanna sniff it. I wanna know if they're lying to me or not. It is white. I got on my nose. And hi Kibro. It don't smell like nothing. On the on the for real for real. Hold on a second. It don't smell like nothing. That's high key weird. That is high key weird. Okay, I'm excited. I am excited. Let's um go ahead and apply. I'll put I'm put a little bit on my arm first, my hand first. Let's see. Bam, it is white. We are, you know, it's very light. It's not sticky. It's pretty thin. I almost feel like it's like something that has like a lot of water in it. Um, I'm rubbing it into my hand. And it's, it's in there. Wow, it's gone. Okay, hold on a second. Let me put this to my face. Wait, hold on a second. Wait, hold on a second. Okay. We're just going to do one side of the face. We're going to test this out. We're going to do one side. We're gonna get it in here. Uh-huh. Oh, I'm crusty. Oh my goodness. Get under the eyeball. Over the eyeball. Bro. Bro. Wait, hold on a second. Okay. 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 Okay, I hope you can see what I'm doing. You probably can't. Okay. Okay, so, so far this side of my face has sunscreen and this side does not. Um, immediately off the bat, very thin. Like, it's like, like, it's not like thick, which I like. I don't like thick stuff, except for myself. <laughs> Anyways. Um... It does leave a nice shine to it. A nice shine. For a second, I was scared because it was getting a little white over here in this area. But it's gone now. And don't... Okay, now I can smell a little bit. If I like breathe really hard. But like just on my face. I don't really smell the sunscreen. At all. So there's no offensive sense. My skin ain't going crazy. It's nice. I can tell that I have the product on my face. Like you can tell that you have some screen on your face. Um, but it's not bad. I'm gonna do the other side. Hold on a second. Let me put a little more. Let me put a little more on here. Oh my god you know what i want to do i'm gonna put some foundation on i'm gonna put some money this is coming out this is this. okay off the bat i approve i approve this 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 is approval 100 percent 100 percent approval okay i approve this 100 percent let me get close like i don't look pale i just look a little oily i'm gonna put some foundation on this i want to see what this looks like hold on a second oh, i'm stuck i'm gonna take this primer I'm gonna go under my eye. I just wanna see. I just wanna see like how it's gonna. At the moment, my skin is not as good as usual. Cause I have like hella pores. Um, and also my skin is like a bunch of different colors. Especially like around here, it's like a yellowy, like bay, like light beige, yellow. I don't know what it is. Then it gets pink, and then it's like darker, and then it's darker here. It's just like a lot. I have a lot of issues going on but I could use this for primer instead of an actual primer depending on how it lays okay oh oh well oh Juvia's Place Foundation oh well hold on wait a minute this don't look bad this don't look bad I need some powder because I am oily. I'm not going to do my forehead. 
because I am oily. Just from the, the screen, the sunscreen is, is a little oily. Um, I'm gonna put a little powder, just a dab or two, just to see. But I actually really like this. I really like it. Like I'm gonna continue to use this. I'm gonna use it over the course of some days. I mean, how do you really test if sunscreen works or not? Like if like you don't get cancer, like. Uh, Come on, like that's not a, I mean, I don't want kids. What I'm saying is, how do you test, if, how do you know for it? I'm gonna cut that out. <laughs> that is a horrible sentence. But on a real note, how do you test if something you, like you just don't know. I just have to trust that whatever says it's SPF, whatever. I just have to trust that it, it it's, it's spoofing, like, like it says, you know? This looks good. This looks good. Okay, out of 10 moons, this is a 10 moon, a 10 moon product. 10 moons. No scent, it's sheer, it's moisturizing, it got jojoba, it got avocado, it's cool, it ain't got whatever those little chemicals are that I don't know what they mean, it ain't got that. And it's 30. The packaging is very nice. I really like it. I think this is, I want to say $15. I want to say the sunblock is $15. I'll put the price. But it was less than $20 for sure. Wasn't that expensive because I bought it and you already know if I'm buying something it ain't going to be. Well, that's not true. Ah, take it back. <laughs> I've made some horrible choices in my life so I even wanna, I'm not even going to say that. But it wasn't that expensive. Um, I'm happy to, in, to keep using this. I'm going to keep using this. I want to see how it affects my skin over a long period of time. I'm excited for this. I'm excited for them. Alright, okay, great. Okay, perfect. Great. Oh my god, this is a ton of 10. I really love this. I really love the black and gold packaging. I really do. Um, like I said, you can find this at Target. They do have a website, blackgirlsunscreen.com, I think it is. And you also can find these at Ulta. So I'm really happy with this, guys. Please, if you need a sunscreen, check it out. Um, it's pretty good. It just my skin doesn't itch, it's not irritated. Everything's chilling. The makeup went on really nicely. Um I'm really loving it like I'm like really like in love with it and I just want to say 10 out of 10 and um before you go I want to tell you about a little something I'm doing it's called 12 days I apologize in advance 12 days of Christmas yeah um for 12 days from I think like the 14th to the 25th 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 yeah from the 14th to 25th I'm posting a video every day um every day of the week Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, all those days, yeah? All Christmas themed. It's gonna be so exciting. Got so many things going on. And the new schedule, yeah? Saturday. Every Saturday in the morning, I'm gonna post a video instead of Sunday. Um, So check it out, you know what I'm saying? Because Sunday's like, I'll be watching, I'll be, I don't know. Just Sunday wasn't working for me. Obviously, I haven't been posting like, like four or five weeks you know so Sundays um, you know not good Saturdays is what we're going for and next week what are we doing next week I actually have a calendar oh my god let me see what's happening next week wait wait hold on a second oh, I'm gonna get to, hold on don't leave me I spilled chocolate milk on my calendar oh next week we're gonna be doing some Korean type of things we're gonna be doing a Korean snack box next week. Me and my brother, I'm gonna convince him to do it with me. And probably my mom too, if she's around, which she will be. So I'm really excited for that. So please like, comment, share, subscribe to the channel. Check out all the links down below and everything. I'm gonna link my mother's website for the candle business if you guys wanna check that out. I am going to also link um, the link to this sunscreen for their website um as well as please follow me on my instagram and my tiktok they tell with midnight i post on there decently and please like comment follow share subscribe i know i said that already but i'm just gonna say it again please subscribe please subscribe subscribe bye